Today we're opening a box of vintage, some third party, Yu-Gi-Oh packs. Time to do, 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 do. What's up guys, we're back with another epic opening video. And as you can see, I have a black Ooh. eye. I got hit in the face playing basketball. I know a lot of people have been asking, so I'm just gonna get that out there right away. So yeah, it looks really terrible. I know, it looks really bad. It looks like there's like a banana peel on my face or something, but let's get right into this. This is a box that was sent to me, well, not sent to me. I bought it from him, he sent it to me, and then now I'm buying it from a viewer and it has some really really cool old school stuff i've been talking to this guy for like half a year like he was like hey man i want to sell you my stuff and then he was like okay and then i finally got back to him and he finally got back to me and we're the, the box is finally here it's going to be some exciting stuff for the channel so i'm really excited to like see what it actually is because i can't even really remember at this point it's pretty expensive so let's see but before we get into it we are giving away a display of Maximum Gold El Dorado. Just make sure to like the video, be subscribed, turn on notifications, and let me know your favorite item from this video. There's a lot to choose from. Also, if you're watching this on the day this video came out, I'm gonna be doing a Twitch stream for auction series because we're bringing it back for one special episode, potentially two, due to Simo. He's raising a bunch of money for the Crohn's and Colitis Foundation because he himself has ulcerative colitis. So he wants to help people that are like having the same issues and stuff like that. So I'm gonna be doing a live stream, building my deck, opening my packs for that auction series episode. And if you guys wanna to donate to his cause as well, make sure to check out the link down below. I'm gonna have his link from his video. And also in the live stream, we're gonna have the link. So go check it out if you guys want to support that and if you guys just want to come hang out help me have an actual good deck for auction series you can see what i want in the auction and then we'll get ready for the video where i duel them and stuff like that so go check out the twitch stream i think three o'clock central i think is what i'm aiming for three to four p.m today so go check it out if you guys want to see that let's get back to the video all right i'm gonna cut this thing open let's get started we have a note which is perfect we have ruxin big fan of the channel i've always been a fan of Yu Gi Oh, but never followed anyone that was into the hobby until i came across your channel over a year ago love your energy and passion for Yu Gi Oh! I'm really excited to see you open some of these blisters I've had for years, and I've always wondered if there was anything good inside. Can't wait to see your reaction. Me either. It's going to be fun. Also, I have some custom stickers for you and your subscribers. I have a small home business YouTube channel where you can see how I make them if you're interested. Really hope you like them. My channel is youtube.com slash Brandon B. Hope you and your family have a great Christmas and Happy New Year. Brandon B. Brandon B. Thank you so much for selling me these. Also, go check out his channel if you guys want to see how he makes these stickers. I'm excited to see what these are. I didn't mention these before. All right, first off, let's just do this a few at a time. There's a lot of really awesome stuff in here. We're talking Labyrinth the Nightmare Blister Packs. This is unlimited. I mean, you can see they have a little bit of wear and tear. You know, $1.99. Look at this. $1.99. At one point, you were able to buy this pack for less than $2 before tax. That is insane. That is awesome. And uh, not only one, Brandon B went ahead. It looks like he bought multiple of them that one looks like it got ripped off but a bunch of different 199 packs you love to see it five labyrinth of nightmare blister packs these are in the condition that we call opening condition because check them out they're not beautiful they're not like you know display ready they're what we call opening condition these are the ones that you rip open you try to pull something amazing so keep an eye out on the channel because we're going to be opening these up before we get into more product here are the stickers he made these look oh my goodness check these out these look sick and he made them specifically for Ruxin 34, which I love to see. All right, so we've got uh, some Ruxin 34s. These are really cool. There's a bunch of them. There's, oh, there's a little uh, pin as well. Ruxin 34 YouTube, Ruxin 34. Nice, the 34 is looking nice. So it's a bunch of the same ones. Okay, I see. So I've got a ton of these. Oh, what's this? Flare, okay, so that's what the name was. That must be his business. Cause I saw that on the uh, on the box he sent me and I was like, I wonder what this name means. Cause like that wasn't his name on Instagram and stuff. Flare underscore CA. So check it out if you guys want some of those cool stickers. Those are actually really nice, I like them. Oh wait, there's more. There's some Yu-Gi-Oh ones, some generic Yu-Gi-Oh ones. Let's check these out as well. So we have some Ruxin ones and some Yu-Gi-Oh ones. So very cool, got a little variety here. You love to see it. All right, then the second set of stickers. I got a little distracted there. Uh, we got the Yu-Gi-Oh, very nice. We got Konami, pretty cool. We've got, what else we got? We got, oh, look at this one. Little Blue Eyes Toon Dragon, Genzo. We've got, you activated my trap card, brain, oh, wait, brain control. I'm pretty sure they call brain control a trap card at some point. Dark Magician, uh, Shizu. That, I think that's a, a Duel Links artwork. Um, oh, this is definitely a Duel Links. Yeah, that's definitely the Duel Links one. Okay. I tried to play Duel Links the other day, guys. That freaking game costs too much. That's all I got to say. I was trying to build a deck and I was like, I got to buy all these cards or buy all these packs. It was killing me. Uh, Dark Magician Girl. But man, I just want to play the game. We've got a nice uh, little uh, dual disc, whatever it's called. Millennium, Millennium Ring, right? Millennium Ring? Millennium Rod. We got the Millennium... No, maybe this is Millennium Ring. No, Millennium... What is that? I've lost it. I don't know. We've got the Millennium... 
Look, Millennium Puzzle, we know that. There's so, so many small ones, they're falling over the place. Okay, we've got a couple of these, the little, uh, the little eyeball, the scapegoat. Another puzzle, a Yugi. We've got a Wayne Karibo. We've got the Dune World, another Blue Eyes Tune Dragon. Getting a couple of, couple of different ones. We've got the love for that one. We've got the Dark Magician, the Time Wizard. Exodia, Obliterate. We've got ourselves a... What's this guy's name again? Bakora. There we go. We've got uh, Joey Wheeler. All right. Dude, there's a lot of stickers on here. Teo. We've got Tristan. Wow, there are a lot of ones. So if you guys pretty much want anything, he, he probably has it. Kaiba. Yugi. Teo. At it again. we got ooh, Maximilian Pegasus. I can't do his voice. We've got the uh, Democ. We've got the DMG. Dark Magician. Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon. That looks really nice, actually. We've got the Blue Eyes. Wow, there's even more Obelisk. We've got Slifer, Raw, gotta have those, of course. We've got, what is this? Joey, the meme, Joey meme, okay. Oh my goodness, we have memes, this is amazing, look at this. Me and my boy saving the world, love to see it. And then Exodia to finish it off, beautiful. So there was a punch in there, wow, that was a lot more stickers than I was expecting. Pretty awesome, let's get back to the uh, the other stuff, that's, that's some cool stuff, so more. Labyrinth of the Nightmare. Those are unlimited, but still pretty cool. Here's one that you might not have seen. We have double blisters. They used to do double blisters back in the day. We've got Ancient Sanctuary. This is a blister that holds two packs. It's crazy. It's like a, you know, a double wide. You know, it's pretty cool. So you love to see those. Uh, you don't see them very often anymore, though. We got a couple third parties coming in, which is two packs of Yu-Gi-Oh cards or two packs of Yu-Gi-Oh booster cards is what they call it. booster cards. What a weird name. I get that looks like maybe uh, Legacy of Darkness is what I'm trying to say. So two packs there. Legacy of Darkness, Pharaonic Guardian. We've got two more packs of Yu-Gi-Oh! Booster cards with Pharaoh's Servant and uh, looks like Legacy of Darkness again. Pretty cool. But just wait, there's more. We have a three pack of Labyrinth of Nightmare. This is first edition, so you'd love to see that. First ed packs, really cool. These were $8.99. It was $11.91. Now it's $8.99. Look at that steal of a price. Three packs for $8.99. That is insane. Three, $3 a pack for first edition is awesome. Then we have Magician's Force, and we're, we're big time now. We've got KR Toys, $3.99. Hey, look. We know how to pull those Dark Magician girls. They might be damaged, but we know how to pull them, okay? Then we've got a Invasion of Chaos or an Invasion of Chaos. We've got a second Invasion of Chaos. That's pretty cool. Wow. There's some big ones coming up. Okay, Invasion of Chaos. Two of those. That's nice. The next one is whew, Legend of Blue Eyes Unlimited. The only blister of Legend of Blue Eyes, you know, that's legit Konami made or whatever. You can't get first editions, unfortunately. So that is the OG of blisters right there. Man, there's so many in here. We've got Metal Raiders now. Oh, wait, we've got a scapegoat on the ground that I missed. <laughs> we got Metal Raiders. That's super sick. I mean, look at all these. They're a little beat up. Toys R Us, the good old days, man. Some of these blisters are falling apart. They're just ready to be open, which is exciting. We've got a couple of Legacy of Darkness. Beautiful, beautiful packs. Then we have a couple of Magic Ruler. These are actually in a lot nicer shape. Magic Ruler Unlimited. Not first edition, but still really cool. Love to see those with the Relinquish on the back. Amazing. I just love how they got the grayed out like monster back there. It just looks amazing. There's still so much in here. We got Ferrani Guardian. That's first dead. We got an Unlimited, 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 Unlimited. So one first dead Ferrani Guardian. The rest are Unlimited. That one's ripped. That one wants to be open. So we got more blisters. We're going to have a blister fest soon. It's going to be pretty epic. Speaking of blister fest, we're not done yet. We got Ancient Sanctuary. One, two, three. Most of these are unlimited, unfortunately, but they're still going to be super fun to open. Blisters that we will be destroying, unfortunately. Sorry, guys, if you like sealed product, but most of them are ready to be opened anyway. All right, now we got a few more items. Here's some that you've probably never seen. We have a plus seven bonus cards. This is made by Legends, whatever that is. That looks like the uh, the new Ninja logo. <laughs> you know what I mean? That little weird little... Yeah, you know what I'm talking about. All right, then we got the uh, Legacy of Darkness and the Legend of Blue Eyes, plus seven cards. I'm sure these are awesome cards from Starter Deck Yugi and Starter Deck Kaiba. I guarantee they are. So I've never actually seen this Legends thing. This was $9.99, so this is pricey. Got Legend of Blue Eyes. Those are pretty expensive. $9.99 at KB Toys. Pretty cool. I mean, just some really awesome, unique blisters that you don't really see anymore because they used to sell all these just repackaging stuff, trying to get them out, you know, kind of like they do now with mystery boxes, but they're just repackaging cards, trying to sell them in a different way. Because back then it was like, we got to get rid of these Legend of Blue Eyes Unlimited. We got so many of them, you know, and now it's like Legend of Blue Eyes Unlimited. Amazing. And speaking of one Legend of Blue Eyes pack guaranteed Yu-Gi-Oh! four packs. So we have Ferrana Guardian, Legend of Blue Eyes, looks like Ferrana Guardian, Looks like Legacy of Darkness. So Ferrani Guardian Legacy of Darkness seems to be the ones they were trying to pedal off 
and LOB, which is, funnily enough, this is not an original, like, uh, Konami logo. So if you look at this one, we've got the original Konami logo, means it's 2002 to 2003 pack. They changed it to 2003, so it could have been early 2003. This one actually could be maybe 2003 or four, or something like that. So this is not a 2002 pack, because it got that red Konami logo, like here. But all Ferrana Guardians have that, because, or did they change? I can't remember. It might have been after that. I don't know. Maybe, maybe not all Ferrana Guardians. I think maybe it's split. Not sure. But uh, yeah, 2003 was when that changed. All right, our final item. I mean, just obviously really, really cool stuff that we're going to be opening on the channel. So keep an eye out. If you guys like old school openings, we'll be opening this stuff up. It's going to be awesome. So once again, thanks again to Brandon. Excited for selling me these. Uh, I'm glad I finally got a hold of them because we've been back and forth for a while. And uh, here we go. Magic Ruler, Legacy of Darkness. Two packs of Yu-Gi-Oh! Plus 40 card protector sleeves. I hope these are like the old valuable ones. No, they're not. They're the crappy ones. Okay, there's some like old school sleeves that people really like, so that'd been cool. This is still a really cool product, so we're definitely going to open it up at some point. Uh, we're not going to have a video like this without opening a pack because we're just showing so much awesome stuff. Let's open one of these packs. I think we open this. How about this Veronic Guardian pack? This one that's ripped. This looks like a perfect ended. So we're going to open this up to end off the video. There's going to be some cool openings in the future, so make sure you subscribe. I'm going to open this thing up. Let's see. Some of these are just completely falling apart. I mean, just already ready to go. These blisters, they eventually, if, especially if they're not in minty condition, can really like the glue can fall apart. But the pack itself seems to be pretty nice for the most part. Check this out. Yeah, the pack seems to be pretty good so you always got to be careful with the beat up blisters that they haven't been like messed with or whatever but this one seems to be pretty solid for the most part let's see what we can get inside of Ferrana guardian there's some amazing comments so let's see if we can pull something a uh you know a lava gold would be pretty cool so we got the master key on she make sure to let me know in the comments your favorite product that we had today some pretty good stuff we got a soul eater a living wonder of mystery just like this thing on my face yeah it's a wonder of mystery arsenal bug beautiful Royal Tribute. Ooh. Right of Spirit. Yeah, look at the centering. Oh, beautiful. Beautifully bad. <laughs> oh, a metamorphosis. Let's go. We'll take it. Way OC, but we'll take it. These corners are not looking so hot. You check that out. Ferrani Guardian was not. It was in top in terms of quality control, you think now is bad. Ferrani Guardian was awful. Everything was off-centered. Everything had like corner issues, like the edges were all bent. It's it's insane. So it's still a nice card. We'll take it. We've got the Serpent of Catabolism disturbance strategy we are recording i just checked 17 minutes in and oh this might be a foil this this the the edge kind of looks like a foil let's see what it is oh it's a magic card okay Ooh, a dark room of nightmare okay so we got a super rare and we got a metamorphosis that's actually a pretty good ferrana guardian pack you'll love to see it dark room of nightmare definitely off centered on that super rare but this actually is probably worth more this metamorphosis which is insane are we going to get a foil print of this ever who knows? Maybe. Starlight? I don't know. Ghost? Who knows? If you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to subscribe to the channel. It's the third time I've said that. Uh, you guys didn't see it, though, because it got edited out. And make sure to check out the channel for more blister openings. I keep saying channel. Let's just keep going. Let's do it. Shoutouts to Tone Fo Show, Daxter, Tomato Juice, JT Cho, TCG Trusted Cards, Puffins of Doom, Ernesto Deanda, Dizzy, Flexi Boy, Hoppus, Choice 333, Miss Cycle, James Jance, Frankie Martinez, Ananda Tai Show, Christopher Ward, Ian Musa, Junior Barding, Mike Nance, Mimic Gecko, Shadowfall, and Thomas McLean. Thank you guys for supporting the channel, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.